Hello clever clogs, Dira Kichlu here to welcome you on International Literacy Day. It's the 8th of September and uh, I'm excited to introduce to you the first guest on our channel Clever Clog. Gayatri is a well-known storyteller and a blogger. I've listed her uh, details below. Her blog Story Tree is all about reading and writing. So who better than her to tell us a story on, on this special day today? Over to you, Gayatri. Hi, kids. My name is Gayatri and I am a storyteller. And I'm extremely delighted and honored to be invited to Dira Kichlu's Clever Clog YouTube channel for a story reading. Today is World Literacy Day. And we have an absolutely wonderful story planned for all of you extraordinary children. But where is my book? Oh, fairies around me. Could I please have the book? Here it is. Fairies, thank you. Oh, and what a marvelous book to pull out. So you know what? This is actually very special to me, this book. Buddy Finds a Friend by Matthew Price. This was my 11 year old's most favorite book when she was a little girl. So this is the story that I'm going to read out to you today. It's about a friendship between a dog and a cat. Ah, oh, who doesn't love dogs and cats? So Buddy has a friend. Can you see the cat and the dog together? They are buddies. She appeared suddenly one day when Buddy was eating his food. She had some really annoying habits. She would eat out of Buddy's bowl. Buddy didn't really like that very much. And she did scratch like everybody else scratches. Scratch, 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 scratch. And she was always washing herself all day long. Wash, wash, wash. Now, when she wanted to step into Buddy's basket, that's when the problem happened. Buddy shouted really hard at her. Ooh, look, there she is jumping out of the basket. Not very happy. And that was when she ran away. Now that was all all right. But when she didn't appear for supper, that's when Buddy got really worried. He finally found her in the garden where it was raining hard, hiding and he decided to bring her right back. Buddy showed her how to dry herself. But what did she do? Mm, she just kept washing and washing and washing herself. She even washed Buddy, but he didn't mind. He was just so glad to have his friend back. Thank you very much. I hope you enjoyed this wonderful story, which is a favorite of my little one. And I hope to see you again. Bye.